everyone, so today I'm going to do my February favorite, and yes, it is a little bit early, but you know, I have a better video planned for Saturday. So let's get started with my favorite. Alright, so my first favorite would have to be my MAC concealer, and this is actually an NC35, which is probably a little darker in my skin tone color, but it like blends in well. It looks like this, and I'm sorry that it's dirty, it's just that I use it every single day, like you can tell I got these at the end of January and it's like this this is what it looks like and maybe like on skin tone like my um, wrist skin tone is way too light for that but that's how it looks and this gives you the perfect amount of coverage I use it on my blemishes and my under eyes which is perfect my second favorite I've already said it in my January favorites but it's the colossal cat eyes mascara by Maybelline and I really like this mascara because of the brush, how it's just curved. It makes your eyelashes curved and literally, I don't need an eyelash curler. So this is perfect for me. My next favorite is the MAC blush and this is actually in Dainty. It's a very natural looking blush, which is why I got it. Um, it's this one. It's a mineralized blush, which is a little bit more pricey than the normal blushes, but it's still good. Um, you can see, you can barely see it, but that's what I like about it. I mean, you know, I can use this every single day and, you know, nothing would be bad about it because it's all natural. And what I like is that it comes with a lot of products, so I don't know if you can see that it's kind of like up, bumped up. Now, I've been loving this literally so much and it's the MAC Cream Sheen Glass and it's in Paper Lantern. So, sorry, I was holding that backwards. So I really like this lip gloss because it's natural looking and you can't tell it from like right now but the lip gloss is actually like halfway down and I barely got in the end of January so you know you can tell that I've really been loving it a lot. What I like is that it just gives you shine and it's not sticky. My favorite nail polish though as you can see I kind of went a little bit obsessed over nail polish and there's my nail polish back but over there so if you want a nail polish collection leave it in the comments below. But my favorite nail polish of February has been the LA Colors Color Craze Nail Polish and this is in Radiation. It's a really pretty metallic blue color. I mean the only thing I would say I would have to complain about this is that the LA Color nail polishes they don't dry really fast. You know you need to leave it overnight. You can't just use this like oh you know I'm going to go out and I'm paint my nails and I can go now. No you have to leave this overnight and put a top coat on it because it is very sticky and it does not dry fast. Now I've been using this lotion for the month of February but it's from Victoria's Secret, so I don't know if you guys are allowed to buy from there, but I am. If it depends on lotion and um, perfumes and maybe makeup, but that's all. So it's the sheer love scent, and I really love this scent. It's a really nice scent. I would say it's like a normal lotion scent. You can find other normal lotions, but I'd say, like, I don't know. It's just one of those scents that has the best scent ever. That did not make any sense at all, but, um, you know... It's the scent. Now, I barely got this out a week ago, but I've been getting so many compliments on it, and honestly, I love it too, and it's the Bath & Body Works Hand Sanitizer in Peach Bellini. I think that's what it's called. Is it called Peach Bellini? Correct me if I'm wrong, but it's a really nice smelling scent. I have got to say, this has probably been my favorite Jarvex of Bath & Body Works from right now. Since I've only like tried two of them, it's probably my favorite. I've tried the Sweet Pea, which is also very good. You can see many people on YouTube have that, and this one's really good, so... It smells like peaches. I mean, lots of people just take this from me because they want to use it. And my last favorite is actually the Diary of a Women Big Kid, The Ugly Truth Book. I got this at High Price Books. You guys know I get most of my books at High Price Books. I don't know why, but I just do. So I really like this book. I've been loving the Diary of a Wimpy Kid series since a long time ago. So thanks for watching everyone and don't forget to hit the subscribe button down below. And thanks for 500 subscribers on my other channel, GG Actress. Bye everyone!